in the jhana states things vanish. So, you got things like your memory, you got things like your will. How can you know what those things are? This simile you've heard so many times but it's the best one to explain the answer to the question. A tadpole born in the water, lived in the water, cannot understand what water is. Doesn't matter how many books on water the little tadpole reads. Doesn't matter if it goes to chemistry classes in university, in Abhidharma classes to try and find out what water is. A tadpole can't understand water no more than a fish can understand water. Born in it, lived in it, all around, always there. But the difference between a fish and a tadpole is a tadpole one day becomes a frog. And a frog one day jumps out of the water onto dry land. And the first time a little tadpole becomes a frog and jumps onto dry land, that blows her mind. They never experienced anything like this at all in its life so far. Something which has always been there is now missing. For the tadpole, or now the frog, that's called water. Now, a frog can understand what water is, once it's gone. That's what the meaning of jhanas are. There's so many things disappear in the jhanas. And because they're gone, like you know, your body in the five senses, only now, can you really understand what the body is and the five senses are? Your will vanishes in jhana. Only now can you understand what this will is. And your consciousness starts to vanish. Now you can understand what this consciousness is. Only when it's gone. How can a fish ever understand water? That's the reason why we have the jhanas. But unfortunately though, it's so hard to get jhanas. You know why? Because we have no wisdom. And we can't have wisdom without the jhanas. This is you know, the difficulty of like practice. Nati jhanang apanyasa panya nati jayato. There's no jhana without wisdom. There's no wisdom without jhana. So this is where you, know, you get a little bit more insight and wisdom. And that makes you let go a little bit more. A bit more wisdom, a bit more letting go. The two of these things work together. More understanding, more letting go.